I'm Anil Kumar and in this video we will see how to find volume for cylinder and cone combination. So uh, let us consider a cylinder. Let me just sketch one here. Let's say this is this is a cylinder for us. And uh, let us say height of the cylinder is h. So we'll do a very general question so that it helps you to understand the strategy and then solve similar questions. And let's say the radius is r for us. So we have a cylinder whose radius is r and height is h. Now what we will do is we will put a cone on top of it. So let us say we put a cone here so it forms a structure like this. So that is the cone on top of it. So this is let us say the cone right. So, so that is the cone on top of the cylinder so we can say kind of like this. So as you can see the cone will have exactly the same radius as the cylinder. So radius is same and let us assume that the height is also same for the time being. It could be different but in this particular case let me take height is exactly same right. Now the question here is find the volume of this structure right. So find volume of this combination. How will you do it? Now I am going to show you a very simple way of doing it. One we know what is volume of cylinder what is volume of cylinder? The uh, volume for cylinder is pi r square area of the base pi r square times height right that is volume of a cylinder. Now what is volume of a cone? Volume of a cone is one third of pi r square h. Volume of a cone is one third of volume of the cylinder. That is to say that you can fit in three cones in this particular uh, cylinder. Do you see that? You can kind of fit in three cones. That is the strategy. These are the three cones which you can fit into a cylinder and that is how you get this formula, right? So combination will be what? Find the volume of cylinder and then add one third of it, right? So we say volume, total volume, right? So will be volume of cylinder plus volume of cone right so in this case it is pi r square h plus one third of pi r square h do you see that just add them up correct so when you take 3 as common denominator this becomes 3 plus 1 4 so it is 4 over 3 pi r square h correct so that is how you could easily find volume of such combination of three dimensional figures right now here is a question for you based on the calculations which we have done here is a question for you the question is find volume of given shape if h is equals to let us say 10 centimeters and r is equals to uh, let us say 3 centimeters okay so find volume combined volume right so what you can do is you can do it in two different ways you can individually find volume of cylinder and the cone add them up or you could just find volume of cylinder and then make it one third and add it to get the total volume you will find that if you use this way finding volume of the cylinder and adding one third of it to get the total volume helps to save time. So that is very important. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.